um, Aguila. Did I say that right? Uh, Achila. 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 <laughs> sorry. It's just all right. <laughs> so she was uh, riding by and said she heard the piano out on the road. All the way out on the road. That's, That's what she said. Wonderful. Mm-hmm. I also have yeah. pretty good hearing, anyway. So, but I heard it. <laughs> Oh, mm -hmm. that's great. Yeah, it's very good to know. Uh, we only want to attract those with really good hearing anyway. <laughs> right. <laughs> oh, my word. Kidding. We also <clears throat> found out that um, Harry Harry Turner, the owner of the bridge, <clears throat> lives in that white house over there across the road. Oh, does he? Mm-hmm. That is interesting. Uh, I thought it was interesting. <laughs> So, but you know, it's uh, it's people in town, right? Yes. So I'm hoping that uh, the gunsmith <clears throat> can get opened up. Oh, that would be the more nice. The better. Right. That's probably the biggest one, really. I mean, the parlor house <clears throat> is nice, but there's a lot of people looking for gunsmiths. Oh yes. All the amenities should be here in Rhodes. Including a stable. Right. If it will entice folks to actually spend time here. Mm -hmm. Yes. And honestly, exactly. to be fair, I'm not a big fan of Santony. So the only reason I usually go there is because there's like nothing here. I know. Mm -hmm. It's terrible. <laughs> well, we'll have to work on that and get stuff here. <clears throat> yes. Activities and reasons for people to come here. Events or something. Oh. oh. Which was uh, telling me that she, you guys were pondering about the uh, mariachi band. I actually do know them, so I told them I will talk to them and see if they're interested in oh, uh, playing at the uh, opening. Wonderful. Mm hmm Yeah, that's a great idea. Yeah, and they're always fun. <laughs> Trust me, they are fun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that would be <coughs> awesome. I mean, that really would be perfect. It would show, uh, you know, the, I, the grand opening should set the tone for uh, the style of the parlor house. All right. I mean, if we brought in classical music, that's going to set a certain tone. Oh, exactly. Right. <laughs> Mariachi bands, um, depending on the song, they can be party and uh, what is the word? Well, uh, not so much classical, but you know that what like those are. Somber. I guess it would. Be more of a fancy type thing they can do both depending mm -hmm. on the song so yeah well we're hoping that we come to be known as more uh, grounded down to earth Ooh. so i think we will oh i am sure once uh you have your uh, opening i'm sure people will be coming here quite uh, often some of the folks I talked to, they seemed very, very happy that uh, this was opened now. Oh, well, that's good to hear. Yeah, it's wonderful. <clears throat> yeah. You know, and I think uh, more than anything, we want to be able to offer a little bit of something for everyone. Right. Ooh. Yep, exactly. Yeah. We may not be able to put in as much time as, like, uh, what goes on over in Blackwater. But we can do a good chunk. And once we get fully staffed, that's going to be the key. So Claire over in Blackwater did a really good job staffing her establishment up so that it operates uh, maybe not 24-7, but they are quite, open a, pretty quite a few hours. Yeah. Right. Yes. Yeah. yeah, she's done a really good job. Well, it takes time, and I'm sure you guys will get there. Oh, yeah. yeah. We will. Yeah, and that's what she said. You just got to spend, you know, the time like this when it's empty so that people realize that Come to trust someone's going to be there when they when they come and they'll just you know they'll be regulars so to speak who end up staying so plus all of the new people coming in off the boat yes yeah. they come off the boat and uh they come into roads and they can get everything they need at roads that would yep. be right. nice that would be nice yeah yeah we had at least two just last night who were new oh really that is wonderful mm-hmm that's actually really good. Yeah. Not gonna lie. We should go downstairs. I agree. In case someone comes in, we don't want to miss them. <laughs> we don't want to miss saying hi. Right. 
Hi, what can I get you? Hey, is that what it is? Kinda. No, we want to be welcoming. Right. Yeah. Yeah, those front tables, that would be 16 open seating <laughs> if we get it open. <clears throat> yeah. I mean, aren't those just technically ben benches with a, mm -hmm. a table in front of it? Yes. My way of thinking they are. <laughs> Same here. What would be really nice, and this probably be too much to ask, is that, uh, I don't know if you know, but when you're in a wagon, and let's say you have a wagon full of people, and you go to whisper, everyone in the wagon can hear you, and only the people in the wagon. No one else outside. If something similar could be done with each booth, then people could have their private conversations. Hmm. That is quite interesting. I'm mm -hmm. not sure if um that would be able to be done. You might have to put like a curtain or something, but... Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, that would, this way, whatever's going on out here wouldn't disrupt people at the tables. Could you get four groups sitting over there? And if somebody uh, isn't whispering, you know, then that's quite a few conversations going on. Mm. Yes. But that's down the road. I think, I think what we need to do is start oh, getting oh, that people popped. coming in, in and out of here. And then uh, I think mm -hmm. the government would be more inclined to... Uh, open up requests like that just getting yes. seating in there first and foremost the yes. stable and seating the stables will be have you thought of any more ideas for uh, how we could collaborate together like benefit each other well like i said um well incarnations does have a social club so I'm trying to think on a couple of things in regards to that However, mm -hmm. you did mention possibly having a masquerade type thing eventually. Oh, yes. Um, I do see that some of those things, um, the women wear flowers on their wrists. Mm hmm Could probably provide something like that. Yeah. Complimentary Absolutely. at the door. Yeah, I think that's a really good idea. And maybe, uh, I don't know how fancy the mask is. If if the masks have like flowers on them, if people want to do their masks up at your establishment, if that's a thing. <laughs> well, I mean, we do work with flowers, so it shouldn't be too much of an issue. Yeah, I wouldn't think so. So we're definitely having a masquerade party. Um, <clears throat> we just have to figure out the when, like, is there a, a standard time of year where people would have that. I would think maybe in October. It is possible, yes. So, or maybe we do uh, two or three of them throughout the year. I think it should be an annual. An annual masquerade? An annual event. Mm-hmm. Mm, I like you that. Get too many of them, then they're gonna kind of lose their... Sure. Uh, ...impact. <clears throat> Once a year gives everybody a year to plan their mask, so to speak, or whatever, you know. Mm hmm <clears throat> Yeah, that makes sense. Maybe also uh, the, um, the new clothing at the clothing stores would be put out, and there would be some better offerings for dresses and women oh. wear. Boy, that would be amazing. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I heard it's coming. <laughs> so, are they just going to add new clothes to the current what they currently have in stock? Or is it going to be a complete overhaul? Because I need to know if I have to remake my outfits. Oh, boy. Yeah. I have that's quite a, a bit question. of them. Uh-huh. I... That's a good question. I don't know. I thought it would just be, a, a, you know, additional items. But yeah, if they completely overhaul it, there would be a lot of people having to, uh, pretty much everybody, right? No, they'd have to add two. Otherwise, everybody that has existing clothes, would you'd have a bunch of naked people running around. <laughs> <laughs> and that's yeah. a scary thought. 
Yeah, it would be first day all, right. all over again. <laughs> all right, so by that logic, it's probably an addition then. I bet right. it is additional. Mm -hmm. Hey, corpse! How are you, sweetie? Welcome to the yeah, stream. I just wish we had a better idea of. Uh, Hope when, your day's going well. Be offering.